Hi Becca, hi Jenny. This video comes in multiple parts. Part 1. I like that this is a thing now, us addressing each other. I didn't expect both of you to also do it. You guys know you don't have to, right? It's just that I'm gonna keep doing it. It's too hot to go outside right now, so no garden content today, I'm afraid. The potatoes have to stay in the ground for a bit longer. And that brings us to part two. I have some puzzle glue here, and I have a finished puzzle that I need to glue. Ta-da! Oh, it's upside down. Do you think I can just... This, this is dangerous. I've never glued a puzzle before, and I didn't think to put a piece of cardboard under this or whatever, so... Oh my god, this is so dusty. I've had this sitting here for like months. Okay. Yep, so there's two bottles in here. And the applicator! I did watch a video tutorial on this like a week ago. Maybe I should make it not dusty first? Not recommended for use on wooden puzzles. This is- this isn't- what's a wooden puzzle? This is made of like cardboard and paper, but like paper is basically wood, isn't it? Let's just go for it. I mean, at the end of the day, you're just spreading glue on a puzzle. Like, it'd be pretty hard to do wrong. Okay, we're going, boys. Whoa. Oh, this is so satisfying. Okay, I need more glue. I'm inhaling all of the glue fumes right now. Glue's getting on the table, but really, what, the, what did I expect? Everything is sticky. The glue is starting to dry, so I think we're done here. Oh god, I just put the applicator down directly on the table. Why? It says to leave it for at least an hour, so I don't think you guys are going to get to see the finished outcome today. I mean, you can see how it looks right now with all the glue on it, but it really doesn't look that different from before. <laughs> Excuse me, Reese. Reese. Now that everything's clean and not sticky, my hand's still a bit sticky. Anyways, that brings us to part four, three? Part three! I need a new puzzle, don't I? I'm gonna find a jigsaw puzzle to buy online. Riveting content, I know, but I just don't have the energy to be as chaotic as I was last video all the time. There was this Kickstarter for, like, some really cool puzzles that I saw the other week. Not the other week, it was like months ago. The Kickstarter's probably like definitely ended at this point but i really wanted to get one of those puzzles it's really cool it's like it's designed so that you know how pu i'm terrible at advertising things so normal puzzles they look great when completed but in the process of putting it together the art isn't as enjoyable because you just have a blue square or some blurry leaves so these puzzles are designed so that each puzzle piece, it's like its own piece of art. If that makes sense. Oh, my door just opened by itself. And each puzzle piece is interesting. You have a great time while putting it all together, and then there's a surprise at the end. Very mysterious and interesting. I'm just advertising this Kickstarter now. What are they called? Magic puzzles? <laughs> I believe I saw Hank Green advertise this, Becca, so maybe you're interested. I don't even know if either of you are into puzzles. If anybody else watching is into puzzles, magic puzzles! Is that what they're called? Yeah, yeah, magic puzzles by Magic Puzzle Company. Yeah, so the Kickstarter has ended, but I've just signed up to be notified for when they're available because I want one. Maybe to find a less exciting puzzle in the process. Well, maybe I'll find an equally exciting puzzle, who knows. What? This is gorgeous. Are you kidding me? I want this. <laughs> There's a tuft of dog hair on the applicator. You better be prepared for the fur, Jenny. Jenny's adopting a dog. I'm not telling you. I know you know. <laughs> Uh, Jenny. Yeah, I'm telling Jenny that she's adopting a dog. Surprise, Jenny! <laughs> Let's just say that my parents don't know about this little project we're doing. I'm sure eventually they'll just get used to me doing weird things around the house. 